guys. Today I want to talk to you guys about a guitar um, which I absolutely love. It's a 12 string hummingbird, 1974 this particular model. I've never seen a video on the internet about it so I thought I'd share some light on it. Um, this is called a lawsuit guitar. The reason being, these, this is a Concord range. So the Concord range in, in the 70s was the range that uh, Ibanez produced. And they made copies of various guitars, Guilds, Gibsons, all the, you know, your high-end manufacturers at the time. How I know this is a 74, so you can see the mustache kind of headstock. This is the Gibson headstock. Um, and in 76, Gibson actually took Ibanez, um, and bearing in mind that lawsuit guitars, I see the, the term being thrown around a lot, lawsuit guitars only apply to Ibanez, as Gibson was the only, uh, Ibanez was the only company that Gibson took to, to court. So I know you get a Suzuki's and you get Lyles and, and, uh, and various different hummingbirds, uh, a lot of people wonder if this is uh, solid back and sides. It is not. It is laminate. Um, I've never had any problems with it. The only thing which you can see with a lot of trouble with these uh, Concords is the bubble at the back. Mine hasn't pulled off yet. I mean, I've got a beautiful action on it. I mean, especially for a 12 string. I've put in a Fishman pickup. Uh, yeah, I've had uh, this this particular model is uh, you can obviously see on the inside. This is where you'll see the six eight four twelve. Now, if you want to find out where your guitar's serial numbers for the Concord, you will find it in the inside here. But please bear in mind that Ibanez only started. Um, labeling or serial numbering their guitars in 75 and this of course is 74 these guitars have an amazing sound very rich tone to them uh, I absolutely love 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 this guitar if I can play you a little something so easy even for a 12. If you can find one of these guitars, definitely worth the buck. Their value is round about what I've seen is anything from 150 or say dollars, 150 dollars to anything to about 450, 500 if, if you're lucky. Um, these guitars were mass produced, I think there was a, a few of them uh, made, but like I say, I've played a lot of 12 string guitars and um, this is an amazing guitar. So if you can find it at a reasonable price, look after it, it's an amazing, amazing guitar. Thanks.